Today, the United States Senate voted against Senate Bill 4445 for the second time, a bill that would protect IVF. As Macy Markham tells us, the subject has become a hot topic in the 2024 election. Senate Bill 4445 would provide a statutory right to fertility treatment access, more specifically in vitro fertilization, which is commonly known as IVF. The bill would overrule any state regulations blocking the access of IVF treatments. The Senate voted on the same bill in June, but did not get the 60 votes required to pass it after the majority of Republicans voted against it. The issue came into the spotlight when in February 2024, the Alabama Supreme Court ruled that embryos used in IVF are to be considered children, causing facilities to temporarily stop providing fertility treatments in the state. In June, Arizona Senator Mark Kelly opened up about his experience with IVF before the shooting of his wife, former Arizona Representative Gabby Giffords. The shooting happened just two days before Giffords had an appointment to begin pregnancy via IVF. Arizona Senators Mark Kelly and Kirsten Sinema both voted in favor of the bill, though the bill was blocked, 51 to 49. Democrats are highlighting this vote as a consequence of the overturning of Roe in 2022, credited to Trump-appointed federal judges handing reproductive rights down to the states. In Washington, D.C., Macy Markham, Cronkite News.